Hello once again and greetings from Japan and uh, today we have a 2008 July Toyota Alphard. It's the 350S so it has the V6 three and a half liter engine. It has 47,000 miles on the clock which is 76,000 kilometers and it's an eight-seater with sunroofs um, yeah, nice proper grade four from a Toyota dealer auction. So let's take a look at it. Uh, it we just had a shower, so we just w wiped it down. So you might you might see a few raindrops somewhere, but anyway, the car is a proper grade four with minor touch-ups on the very corners. You got me a little scratch right here. That's about it for the front. Of course, it has parking assist with the sensors. It has 18 inch factory alloys all around with what look like reasonably good radial tires. Um, take a look at the description, it'll have the details on it. Um, nice clean body panels. Little tiny minor things. Wait, yeah. That's about it. Yeah, the radios actually look, they look very good. There's photographs of those in the Dropbox link. As always, refer to the Dropbox link for comprehensive photographs of the underneath of the car. Okay. This, okay. Take a look in the back. Just a very clean non smoker car. I'm not sure what the majority of the percentages of Japanese that smoke, but there's a majority of cars in the auctions, at least the ones we look at, are non-smoker cars. And obviously we don't buy we don't buy them if they've been smoked in. Okay. Nice straight rear bumper. No touch-ups back here. Frog there saying hi, good morning. Come meet you up. I like to come out after the rain. Okay, so we'll open this one. Only has a power slide door on the one side, uh, on this side, on the uh, near side, which is probably the one you will use anyway. The uh, I imagine you seldom open that door into traffic, but on the other side. Okay. Cups all clean. And these things, these little, these are all nice. It's not uncommon for these cars to come in with uh, damaged rail covers. So we, we replace them. They're not cheap. Okay, this is an eight-seater. Comes with two remote keys. Put those in my pocket. And then we'll just have a look in the back. All these Alphars Veil fires come with Isofix points for, for child seats. It's a standard feature. Anyway, interior is nice and clean. Okay, shut the door. And as you can see, it has it has a keyless entry. You just walk up to it. If the if the key is on you on your person, then you can just open the door without the key. 
and of course start the car too. It's a push button start, so the key just stays in your pocket. Okay, 2008, July, 8-seater, 3.5, 350S. And you can't see them, and it's got the sunroofs on top. It's a nice feature. Okay. <coughs> Another corner. You can see a little touch up there. And this one also has front cameras that uh, are useful if you're coming out of a, a, uh, a blind T-junction onto a busier road. This shows you the view up and down the road, which is a very useful feature in Japan because we have a lot of small roads in the cities especially. So it's a useful feature. Okay, take a look inside. Now, oh, this one also has show that, but it has the uh, panoramic TV screen, which is quite nice. Of course it falls into the roof. And, uh, okay, oops. We try as much as possible when we send the cars to put in some kind of a temporary foot cover uh, on, the, uh, on the foot well in the driver's foot well. So the car doesn't arrive with encased mud, which uh, can be. All right, so let's start it up. Get the, get the ignition on. Okay, starting now. And as you can see, all the warning lights are off. Going to turn down the fan. That's already down. That's good. So, all the, and you can see the mileage: seventy-six thousand kilometers, uh, the equivalent of forty-seven thousand miles. So that's a good mileage for the age of the car. Um, and here you have the controls for the sunroof and the power door in the roof here. And you can see the front sunroof. <coughs> and the rear sunroof, it's closed right now, but anyway, it's there. And you have a remote for the rear audio, so that will be sent with the paperwork. Oh, and you've got, uh, what's the second device, I'm not sure, anyway, you don't need those. Um, purely for Japan. This one actually had an ashtray. Look at that. Never seen that before. Anyway, the um, so anyway, whatever, the usual. The um, books and the flip-up drinks tray here. And what else does it have? Cruise control, which is an option, but it's not a standard feature on this model. Leather veneer steering wheel, and as you can see, there's the view of the front camera. And when in reverse, a reverse camera with guidance. Okay, and what else does it have? Hmm. And that's about it for the features other than audio controls on the steering wheel. Good. As you can see, the car is very clean. The headlining is just absolutely clean. Let's take a look at the engine up. And the driver's seat. 
no, no damage at all. Anyway, you've got a whole bunch of photographs that you can look at in detail. And here we have the engine. It's the V6, three and a half liter. This, this is got a lot of recent service. This is uh, 2019. Yeah, 2019, 2017, yeah. It's, um, this car must come with some service history. And what we didn't do was get the auction sheet. Which is here. Okay, <clears throat> it's from a Toyota auction, grade 4, 350S, it's a 20 July, so it's 2008, 76,000 kilometers, 47,000 miles, and pearl white, there's nothing much written, just very, mm, yeah, just comments about the interior and bumper scratches underneath the bumper. There's a little, those little touch-ups I showed you. And the uh, car, it's just A1s and just minor, minor things. Uh, yes, yeah, a genuine proper grade 4 car. So there you have it. 2000 and 8 July with 47,000 miles and 3.5 8 seater with sunroofs. So, if you're interested in this car, please talk to Paul at Japan Auto Agents. And uh, as you might be aware, with the dramatic fall in uh, production. Toyota are cutting their production figures by 40% uh, at, uh, at present. So, um, talking to Japanese colleagues in the auctions, we're expecting auction numbers to fall, and uh, prices are already starting to uh, have indication that they're ri they're rising. So these cars are not going to get cheaper. In fact, the reverse. For how long? I'm not sure. But um, now is probably a good time to buy if you're thinking about it. Anyway, thanks for watching. And uh, if we can help in any way with any questions, please feel free. Bye for now. We are a UK-based personal car import agent trading since 2004. We have a proven track record supplying thousands of Japanese cars direct from Japan to customers throughout the UK. Working as your appointed agent for a fixed commission, we provide a four-step personal car import service. This is an opportunity to cherry pick and safely buy the best high-grade, low mileage cars direct from Japanese car auctions at export trade prices for personal import to the UK. You will make large savings on UK retail prices while buying the best quality cars available in Japan. It's a genuine win-win opportunity. Before the auction starts, background checks and hands-on inspection are carried out by the Japanese staff. Under Japanese law, any accident history or mileage discrepancy must be declared by the auction and shown on the auction report. The truth is the best cars normally stay in Japan. They are bought by Japanese dealers for resale because the best cars will pass a strict Japanese roadworthy test, known as a shaken. Shaken failures are seen in Japan as fits for recycle or export. Many turn up in the UK without the auction port to maximize the dealer's profit margins. 
so it's vital to see a genuine translation of the auction report before the sale starts. Once we have found a particular car, we next arrange our hands-on inspection to confirm the condition matches the auction report and take a large number of photos. Keep in mind, we are not car dealers buying and selling for profit. Why supply bad cars? when it's just as easy to supply a great car from the fountain of supply and simply keep adding to our long established superb track record. Check out our customer reviews or head to our YouTube channel found on our website to see the quality of the cars we supply. To learn more, pick up the phone and speak to us direct without obligation. Ask for Paul. Telephone 01625 560 505 or mobile 07989 560 505. Our email, sales at japautoagent.com.